Hey YouTube, my Doctor Nine Nine here. What's up? What we have here is my uh, Dino Rabbit deck profile video that that got me fourth place at the tournament today. So here we are. Here's what I ran: three rescue rabbits, self-explanatory. Get you your saber source and cobbles. Very good card. It's a really nice card in a rescue rabbit deck. It might get hit to two. We're not so sure, but this is a pretty good card. Free Sabersaurus and free Cobblesaurus, respectively. That's the standard six. This is the rabbit engine. This is the standard stuff you run. And the tour guide engine. Free tour guides and a Sangin. Staples. Really good cards. I like them a lot. Get you your Sangin, and you can overlay into a Levier. And Zim Mains, Leviathan, gives you a lot of options. The free Gua Jurassic Gua Guaibas. These, these cards are really good. They can get another one of these. It can't attack when it, that, the monster summon by the effect can't attack, but it's good for overlaying for Nalaga, Dalka, or any other level 4 XC you have. Some people don't run this, but I choose to run it because it's a kick ass card. And last but not least, the final monster I have is Grammole. I just love this card. It's pretty good. It helped me out in certain situations. Double Smashing Ground. Staple. Free Forbidden Lances. This card really annoyed my opponents a lot. Really gave me a break. It's pretty awesome. One Book of Moon. Staple. Monster Born. Dark Hole. Heavy Storm and Free MSTs. Staple in a deck and Spell and Tracker Destruction. Macro Cosmos. This card. Staple in every deck. It really hurts Insectors. Like, when I used this in the third round, I lost to Insectors, but I won the first game, then lost the next two. But the first game I played, I crippled his combo with this. It's not even funny. So, the Solemn Brigade helped me out a lot, uh, especially against Chaos Dragons. And my first opponent, in game, in first opponent in game three, these were really useful. It pretty much screwed my opponent. My opponent was screwed. He couldn't do anything. Because the Alchemist is really helping him remove and stuff. I negated both of the summons with this and this. I think, or and I think I negated one of them with Lagia, yeah. but one of the the ones I negated was with was, was, was the Solemn Warning. Double Deep Prison really helped me out a lot. Double Bombless also helped me out a lot. Double Torrental, same thing, and Starlight Road also a good card to help me out. Now for the now for the side, I'll show you the side board neck side board next. Here's the extra deck. Double Logia. This card really gave me a lot of victories. Negate a normal or special summon or activation of the spell and trap by giving up both its materials. It's pretty awesome. Dalka. It, it stopped Raiko. It stopped a lot of things. It wasn't even funny. Two Levier. I'm actually taking one of my Levier's out because I'm going to put one of these either in my upcoming deck. I'm going to explain that in a whole separate video, maybe maybe later tomorrow. Bro, I'm building, I believe, wind-ups and Insectors, respectively. But if the Insector deck gets hit by the man list, I'm going to pretty much sell, trade off the parts and just get a good profit out of it before, before the man list starts. But for now, we'll see what happens. Wind-up Zen mains. Another good staple, really good card. It helps me out a lot. So yeah, it's a pretty good card. This card's getting reprinted in both tins, so I am buying two of these to get this. So I'll have two more in my decks. It's pretty good. In my both my new two decks. Um, Leviathan Dragon, another staple, helps me out. Acid Golem, pretty good staple. I killed I killed the Red Eyes Darkest Metal with this. Pretty awesome. Steel Swarm Roach, Roach. This is crucial and um. And certain matchups, really crucial. Utopia. Mummer C for tonight, Utopia Ray. Photon, whatever the hell it's called. Staple, it's also good to hurt your opponent. And My Stroke. And the only circle for Star of the Road, Star is Dragon. Now for the side deck. Here we are. Here's what I run. Three Snowman Eaters. For now. Triple, double Effect Veiler. Staple. Cripples and Zectors. This didn't really help me out a lot, though. Helped me out once or twice, but it's pretty decent. Double Ryo. Stops deck searching. Gores. Emissary of Darkness. One, one 
Sir Ferro de Espirito. Very, very, very German, I think, or Spanish, whatever the hell it is, but pretty good. Help stall. Two challenge. I only sighted it in. I didn't even get a chance to use it, I don't think, but it's pretty decent. Two roll the creates. I, I like this better than Trap Stun. A third deep prison. I might take this out for something else because I might put it in one of my other decks. And last but not least, Mirror Force. Might put it in my other deck, I think. I don't know. So, yeah, that's my uh, wind up deck. I hope you all liked it. This is the deck I used to win to go to the playoffs. I got fourth place with this deck. So, hope you all enjoyed the video. I'll have deck profile videos of my wind up and insector decks within a few days to, once I get all my stuff in. So, I hope you all enjoyed this. I might make the profile tomorrow if I get it in the mail. It might be some proxies in it, but still pretty good. And yeah, I might build a Chaos Dragon build. I'm not so sure yet. I'm still thinking about that. So yeah, I hope to, I hope to see you all at YCS this upcoming fall. More videos coming soon, guys. Comment, rate, and subscribe. Later, guys. Peace out.